what's mentioned in the holy book Quran about the clouds, its formation and how our creator Allah makes this whole process possible. Meteorologists have studied how the clouds are formed. The cumulonimbus clouds begin to form when wind pushes small pieces of clouds to an area where these clouds converge. When the small clouds join together, upward air currents within the larger cloud increase. These updrafts near the center of the cloud are stronger than those near the edges. These upward currents cause the cloud body to grow vertically, so the cloud is stacked up. This vertical growth causes the cloud body to stretch into cooler regions of the atmosphere where drops of water and hail formulate and begin to grow larger and larger. When these drops of water and hail become too heavy for the updrafts to support them, they begin to fall from the cloud as rain and hail. More than 14 centuries ago, these facts were revealed in the Holy Book Quran by Allah, our Creator, to His last and final messenger, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. One of the many signs of Allah's creation, in a primitive, far away desert environment without any advancement of modern science. What does Allah say in the Holy Book Quran? He says, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Do you not see that Allah drives clouds, then He brings them together, then He makes them into a mass, and you see the rain emerge from within it, and He sends down from the sky mountains of clouds within which His hail, and He strikes with it whom He wills, and averts it from whom He wills. The flash of its lightning almost takes away the eyesight, and science has proved it much later. So Allah guides all of the humanity towards the power of His creation and the system of sustenance for all human beings on earth.